here we go okie doke there we go so let me know if you can see that guys we should be seeing airport ceo now hope you can see everything okay i've turned the music off but the rest of the sounds are all kept on i don't know if it's got a tannoy system now because it said do i want to turn off the the ui audio i never had the tannoy when i played it i'm pretty sure it didn't anyway but i don't know if it has like an airport tannoy system i'm not too sure I'm sure that we will find out. I'm sure that we will find out soon enough. Let me know if you guys have, um, have played it. Have you guys played this game? I played it, when did I play it? I'd say I probably played this, it's probably not far off a year ago. I'd say it's fairly close to a year ago I played. Um, so yeah, kind of gonna have to try and remember what you have to do but i have you lovely folks to help as well it looks like they've got a really really handy little tutorial system down here with the little you know tutorials just to let you know what you should be thinking of doing next anyway even if it's not exactly what to do next it should be telling you what to do next so that should um that should really really help i know a few of you guys have played it. a few guys on the discord said that they've played it before so that really helps I hope you enjoy. I think lots and lots has changed actually. It sounds like lots has changed. Um, so we'll try and make sure that we'll try and make sure that we keep on top of everything. Okay. Lovely. Right, so let's get stuck in. We are a few minutes early, but that's fine. Right, so it's telling us to prepare for construction. So it wants us to sign a contract with a contractor. And you do that by opening up the economy tab. Where is the economy tab? Dashboards, contracts, that sounds good to me. Right, economy, and I want to do the blue button, which is offered contracts. Okay, what's in here? Ah, yes, these are construction contracts, because we know that because it's got the hammer and the spanner. It's got Bluebuild, HWY, and Berkeley. I assume these guys will be more expensive. We can have a maximum 167 contractors on site with the hourly fee of £4.20. I think that's per... Yeah, per contractor, okay. These guys here are much more expensive, actually. Much more expensive, and you only have 71. Well, why would I not get £5.30? Why would I not get these? I think I was going to go for these. I, I, I wouldn't see why we wouldn't get these guys. We can have loads of them, and they're cheap. Um, let's do it. Let's just do it. Right, so we've done that. So now we can say that we've done that. How do I say yes? Hide panel. Um, I don't know how to say that I've done that. I did do that, didn't I? Yeah, accepted contracts, okay. So how do I get it to move on to the next? Checklist. Deploy contractors, okay. Open operations tab. Operations, operations. What's the, it'd be nice to know what. Okay, let's just do this. Operations. And then go to construction. Construction, deploy. Do we want to just deploy all? I don't think we'll deploy, we'll deploy all. Let's hold control. And we'll do something like 75. That sounds about right. Have 75 guys on site. Wait for contractors to arrive. Ah, we are on pause, aren't we? So let's take that off pause. Um, wait for contractors to arrive. Okie doke, not a problem at all. Let's speed up time. Here they come, look, in their little buses. Bless their little arts. Oh, game singing about that one. Right, here we go. Time to get your hands dirty. Let's, let's get started with airport construction in order to receive your first general aviation flight. The image below is an example of an airport design that is suitable for GA operation. Okay, so we've got the runway, so we've got it going at one way, so it comes down here into the hangars, then you can go down this long kind of taxiway here, up and then turn right onto the runway. Okay, so really, really simple. Place a small runway, right, let's do that. Is that on here? Hello, Zach, how are you doing? I'm very well, thank you, Zach. How are you? I hope you're good, buddy. 
aircraft infrastructure that looks good small runway we'll get grass at the moment and how do I how do I rotate I love that at the beginning of the game you always got to try and find out how to rotate haven't you how the bloody hell ah here we go right and then we want probably a little bit of room um because I know that when I played the game before I've tried to put it like down here and then when I've gone to upgrade the runway it upgrades it at either end so then I run out of room so I don't know whether to put it kind of in the middle a bit like that let's do that and then we can we can think about that later can't we we'll think about that later right okie doke so now we're going to want to yes runway entries and exits so we're going to want one here and we're going to want that like there then we're going to want one the other way which do i put that like that or do i turn it around no okay love right and i i assume i do something here right click on taxiway to set one way directions okay it's not let me do that there i'm sure that um i can change that later on right so now we want a taxiway how do i get a small runway taxiway foundation here we go so if we get that coming down by i don't know maybe four and then we'll go four let's get that going down to here oh no i've balls that up already let's leave it as five we'll leave it as oh god oh i can just delete that okay that's good let's delete that bit no 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 that's not what i want to do right and then go back to here taxiway foundation and then do that right lovely now how do i turn this one around um i don't know how i do that aircraft stands right so we're going to want those to be like here so let's go one two three four five we'll have to build our road up here as well it's, oh my god look at all those construction workers Look, all of them just chilling out there in the middle. Right, so now we need to connect this, or try and connect this. Oh, it's not built yet. Okay, so let's speed up time. And I thought I need to. Maybe I can only change the direction once it's been built. I don't know. We might only be able to do it once it's been built. Well, that, might, that might make sense. We might, just, uh, we might have to just turn around that runway ahead. Um, that's not a problem at all. Okay, so we'll just wait for all this to be built, really. We've got a few uh, construction workers out there. Fast forward to the next day, no, we don't want to do that. But we can start thinking about our terminal soon. We're probably going to want to start our terminal up here, because that's where we built first, and we can build our road up. How do I build road? Let me know if the music's too loud or anything, guys. Let me know, and we can very quickly sort that out. So let's just build that up to there. There we go. Okay. So that's moaning. Missing taxiway path. Yeah, that's fine. We can get that done. That is a nine problem. Kind problem, I should probably say, shouldn't I? Okay, so they're just bringing everything up. I assume this is like a transit structure. New email. Performance reports. Okay. You can go. Or you can all be deleted. I don't want to know about you. You can all be deleted. Right. Hello, Dr. Kevin. Good morning. How are you doing? I hope you're okay. Let's speed up time a little bit more so we can get that taxiway all finished off and built. Nearly done. Gonna start on that road now. There we go, come on, one last piece, one last piece, come on, come on, one last piece. F10. Oh my lord! What is this? 
Kevin, you're trying to make me go absolutely mental. I hate Christmas. Change day state. Wow, that's um, interesting stuff. Right, so we want to connect this. This needs to come down. Has that taken up? Oh, for God's sake. That's taken up to one of my... No, I want Taxiway Foundation. Deselect Simulate Building. Ah, so they just, they just do it straight away, do they? Just to find it. Am I going mental? Full sandbox. Enable weather, spawn aircraft, spawn staff, spawn passengers, and simulate construction. There we go. Deselect construction. Yep, lovely. Thank you, that guys. I had absolutely no idea you could do that. Right, and then we want foundation. So I want that to come down the middle, really. So if I add, add one more tile. Um, that looks good. And then they come down there, like that. That joins up to there. We'll go and change the one ways. Then these connect up here to our gates. Lovely. Right. So how do I do this? How do I? Ah, here we go. So that needs to be a uh, entry only. This is going to be a exit only. Lovely, lovely. And then this one here we can select um, that that's one way, can't we? One way, no, that way. There we go. And we'll do that here as well. That way. Okay, lovely. Right, that's all done. Right, so now what we need to do is place a small app. Um, air traffic control tower. Let's do that. And we'll place this. And so this is the airport road here, isn't it? I think we should place this up here. Let's place that up there and we can get some airport roads to that whenever we need to. Okay. So we've done that. Uh, that's small airfield. Okay, that's three out of five. Open the airport. Aren't we going to need to build some kind of terminal? Let's get some kind of terminal in. It, um, it isn't paved at the minute, Zach, just because we started the game. I'm just trying to save a little bit of money. I believe then you upgrade it later on down the line. And then you can upgrade it just so it's um, then asphalt. So let's leave a little bit of a gap. And again, we'll leave a little bit of a gap here as well, I think. Right. Um, open the airport and then general aviation can land, okay. Oh no, not that. I want that one. And I go to operations and I open airport. Um, is that all I have to do? Allow general aviation. I think that's all I have to do for the moment, isn't it? Then we start getting the fuel and stuff, I think, don't we? Um, so we need two operational, yeah, allowed aircraft types, yes, open runway. There we go. That should be all hunky dory. We should start seeing planes coming in. Should. Should being the operative word. I hope I've opened the airport. Why does that still say that there? Airport open. So I've done that. Wait for 5G flights to land. Okay, okay, not a problem at all. <sighs> it's hot again tonight, guys. It's hot again tonight. I might have to run downstairs shortly for a new, another drink. Here we go, look. Here's our first plane. Hello. Oh, engine, engine. Send home your constructors. Ah, so can we... Do we not need them? If we've turned off the simulation of construction, I suppose we don't need them, do we? Okay, lovely. <sighs> nice and relaxed tonight, guys. Nice and relaxed. Got another plane coming in.
lovely lovely now we'll get these all these little bits and bobs upgraded to asphalt fairly soon look at this look go home you lot go home bam, bam, ba, dam, bam, bam, bam. yeah okay we'll do that we'll do that not a problem so that's four ga flights landed i suppose we'll be waiting for one more now we can start on our uh, refueling i do remember that here we go i do remember refueling being the uh the next bit that we do redeploy contractors well i don't really want to do that place a vehicle checkpoint to connect public and service roads okay let's have a look at this then and we want the vehicle checkpoint here we go so if we get this um, to come here, I think. I think that makes sense. I believe that needs to go like that. Then you have the road coming up to there. 11 at once. Ah, okay. Then we want a service road. We'll get the asphalt road. And we want that to come from there. Down to there, and that connects up to this bit here. Hello, say birdie, how are you doing? I hope you're all okay this evening. Make sure that's road as well there. Lovely. Place a vehicle depot or service vehicle parking lot. Where do I find these bits then? Vehicle depot or service vehicle parking lot. Well, that's much cheaper. So I think I'm going to get that for the moment. And let's get that in there. Place a small Avgas fuel depot. There we go, small Avgas fuel depot. Can we get that just tucked in there? Oh no, nearly, but not quite. Well, let's leave this up here then. There we go. Speed up time a little bit. Hey, we're almost ready to offer Avgas 100 LL refueling service. All we need to do now is purchase a fuel truck and sign a contract from an aviation supplier. Right, so I need to go into the vehicles tab. I need to go to purchase vehicles. And we need to buy this one here. A small fuel truck. Let's order one. Lovely, lovely juggling. And then once that's done, we just sign a contract with an aviation fuel supplier. So I think we'll wait until we get the vehicle. Uh, purchase vehicle. So we can see here we've got 38 minutes. Let's just speed up time a tad. And since we've got that, we need to get a contract to be a fuel supplier. But we need a contract for a fuel supplier. Okay, lovely, right, our product has arrived. Perfect, right, so now we need to sign the contract. What do I think about instant build? It's, um, yeah, it's an interesting question, Kevin. Um, I'm not too sure. For the moment, because I haven't played the game in such a long time, I think it's good. I just need to get like a bit of a, a, bit of a crappy airport going, um, just to kind of, you know, get familiar with the gameplay, Kind of the mechanics of the game again and then what we could always do i said this on the discord to you guys earlier is then once i feel comfortable we could start a new youtube series or we could have this you know as um airport ceo sundays and we'll just try and i need i want to get familiar with these game mechanics and like you said kevin as soon as they bring out the alpha 36 maybe that's then when we start like a youtube series and hopefully by that point i'll know a little bit more about the game and what we have to do so let's get, but I, I understand the question about is it cheating? Because it is, it's close, isn't it? It is close to thinking that it could be, um, it could be cheating. Right, so we want contracts, offered contracts. So I want one of these fuel ones here. So we've got quite a few. We've got nature fuel, fuel and go, zip fuel, avi fuel, mex avi fuel. So what are you? One pound per litre and jet one aviation fuel, um, 0.2 per litre. That's pretty cheap at the moment. 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2, 1.2,
was. So I'm going to go with this one, I think. I assume that's the only, the only thing that changes. So let's pop that in. So we've done that. We've signed a contract. Wait for the aviation fuel supply to refill your fuel depot. Okay. So this is our truck here. That this parking lot's nice. I see I can upgrade to asphalt at some point. But I think this is new to the game. I don't, I don't remember seeing this. I don't remember seeing this um, service vehicle parking lot. Let's just speed up time a tad. And hopefully we have to refuel someone soon. I need to enable it, don't I? Enable. We had if this was above. You can't need to purchase, sign a contract. Ah, it was a fuel supplier. So this is the fuel supplier. So these were fueling my fuel depot. Sorry, okay, that makes more sense. Then my truck's going to come along and refill from this. And then, then, we can go and refuel our aeroplanes. You can't be put asphalt under. Ah, okay. So here, we want to do that. Turn that on so we can do a refueling service. And I'm sure that he's going to come down here and um, fuel up some of these planes. We need to refuel five. So I'm going to have to see one more plane come in if he does refuel all of these that we have here. That should get us a little bit of money as well, shouldn't it? Can you refuel more, please? We need to refuel five. Is that snow or rain? I think it's rain. That is interesting, Dr. Cameron. I never knew this was a thing. What is I hate Christmas? I don't even want to know what that is. I hate Christmas. That that's not a uh, that wasn't a, a statement. I love Christmas. And who doesn't love Christmas? Well, I suppose some people might not. Bum, bum. I hope you guys are all okay. What have you been up to over the weekend? Has anyone been up to anything exciting? Has anyone done anything remotely exciting or has everyone just been chilling out? That's certainly what I've been doing. I don't think you can beat chilling out guys, I really don't. I don't think you can beat it. What is my airport named? My airport is named 75% um, Rad London. Um, not very not very imaginative um, and I'm called 75% rad and we're based in London. So Belly says that they had little Christmas decoration like hats on the planes you could turn it off using the oh, I hate Christmas button. Ah that makes sense say Birdie. Hello Mark Thompson good evening to you my friend hope you're all okay. Right so I think we need to refuel a couple more planes so we'll speed up time a little bit more. Get some 2030. Hello, you can turn off the weather effects and settings. You don't need to go to the F10 menu. Ah, okay. Thank you for that, get some. I think we'll keep the weather on for the moment. Um, I think we'll keep the weather on. It's always interesting, isn't it, to see some uh, some different weather. But thank you for letting me know, get some. Thank you for letting me know. Have I refueled all of my aircraft yet? I need to refuel five. Come on, little truck. Come on. Come on to your job, buddy. I'll be hanging around all day now, can we? Here we go, right. So now we want to start building out our regional airport. So you can continue expanding your airport for GA aircraft, earning money from servicing these aircraft. Alternatively, you can expand your airport to handle commercial flights which carry passengers. Oh, that's what we want to do, guys. That's what we're here for, isn't it? Right, so we want to get some foundation, which we have got. We need to place a door where you plan to have people entering the terminal. Yeah, okay, please at least one bus stop and one car drop off. That, that my friend, is something we can do. Right, so bus stop, let's get that. I think we'll get a couple of these actually. I know it said we only need one, but let's get a couple of those. And then we need a car stop, a little drop off area. And we'll get a couple of those to begin with. And sidewalk, here we go, sidewalk. Let's get all of our sidewalk for the beginning. There we go. Seasons still change but it affects our disabled. Ah, cool, okay, thank you. Uh, thank you, get some, that's good to know. 
Right, place a door. Yes, doors. Where do I find doors? Seating, bathroom, infrastructure, zoning, terminal. Here we go. Let's get a large door. And we'll get the large door in somewhere like that. There we go. I think that's all I had to do for the meantime, wasn't it? There we go, look, passengers are coming. Is that a passenger or is that me? That's me. Here I am. This is me. Dr. Kevin says, do you get snow in London? We don't get much. Um, I'm not, I don't actually live in London. I live, um, live about an hour away. If I put in a window. <sighs> it's always fun, guys, isn't it? It's always fun play games with brothers. Always manage to cock it up. Can I get any nice doors or is that the only door I can get? Yeah. Let's get a door either side of the window. We'll just pretend that we're trying to be posh guys, all right? Shh, nobody's got to know. Right, okay, so we've got some doors in. Uh, we don't get much snow, um, Kevin, we don't get, we don't get much snow. Um, I live about an hour away from, um, from London. Um, and we do get some, like in the in the winter we can get some. We haven't had any in quite a while. Touch wood, touch wood. We don't want we don't want any. Um, but yeah, we do get a bit actually in the winter. Um, I'm originally from Devon, and we used to get zero in Devon, down in the southwest of England. Absolutely zero. Redeploy contractors, nope. Right, offices and decoration. Drag out a staff room. Do we have a little staff room? Maybe more towards up here, because this is where we've got our kind of fuel depot and stuff, isn't it? So this, I think, is the better space for a staff zone. A ah, staff room, I want, not a staff zone. And we'll get our 11 by 11. Then we can go in here and we'll get out some walls. Let's do that. And we'll get our medium door, I think. I'll need de-icing service later. Ah, okay. Not a problem. Place a few office desks and any type of seating in the staff room. Okay, and where do I find these bits and bobs? Um, ah, seating. Airline tables. Uh, laptop table, is that it? The laptop table and office desk, I'm not sure. Staff. Here we go, office desk. Okay, so let's pop in a couple of those. We'll pop in. We'll go the whole hog. Let's go the whole hog. Um, and any type of seating. We'll go for sofa, standard sofas, I think. And we'll get a couple of these. Lovely. Look at that. Who would not want to sit in a staff room, eh? Um, that staff room area having the wall inside it might cause the people to glitch. Oh, I thought you had to do that. Sorry, that was only... Um, I thought you had to get it to be on the walls as well. How do I deselect it? Um, here we go. I don't want to delete the whole room. I just want to delete the... Uh, so make sure that's the staff thing. Let's just see how that works. We'll see how that works. Um, I don't think it's glitching because I'm in there chilling out. Staff area and staff room are two different things. I put down the right one didn't I? Yes, yeah, staff room and staff area. Wait, what did I do? I done the staff room, didn't I? Let's just delete all of it. Did I do that or did I click the wrong one? I think, I think that's right, I think that's right, because I don't really know what I'm doing, can you tell? Right, decorate your tunnel by putting in some new floors. Well, I don't really want to put in new floors, but I mean, if you want me to do it, then I'll do it. Um, where are floors? Here we go. Should we get some nice wood in here? There we go, look at that. Stuff area can go in the walls, okay. Um, beautify the terminal with some nice plants. Well, again, I don't really want to do that. But we'll pop, we'll pop a plant in there just to uh, brighten the place up a little bit. Right, so that's that bit done. 
you need to hire at least two administrators. They will work on R&D projects and unlock new objects and systems. Okay, I keep doing that. Right, so we need two administrators. Um, how do I know? How do I know who to get? I assume this is good, isn't it? Yes, skill. Okay, they're janitors. We want administrator, we have the top row. You're the cheapest. You're pretty good and you're fairly cheap. So that's one. Um, and then we'll go for someone maybe like Matech. Have I got really Eastern European names or is it just me? Let's go for Matech. There we go. Two administrators should be coming in to the airport. When you place a staff room, it will automatically place a staff area under it. Okay, lovely. So guys, basically, did I do this correctly? I think I've done that correctly, haven't I? Uh, staff room. I think that's all correct. Build office desk for the administrators to work at and have at least two of them working. Yep, yeah, we've got loads of spare space for them. Start the commercial license project in the R and D tab. Oh, thank you, say so Birdie. I need I need you guys to tell me, you know, because I'll, uh, I'll worry. I'll worry, guys. But I think this is all new. I think this is new. I, I don't remember this. Start a new project, commercial license. Um. Okay. 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 Start project. Start that project. Start that. Project. Project. Right, let's have a look at that project. How long How long does this take? Program not unlocked. Administrators are at work. Okay. So I assume they will get on and they'll do lots of bits and bobs for us. Not a problem at all, not a problem at all. R&D project isn't that new. I think that shows how long ago I played the game, um, Kevin. That that is how long. That's how long ago I played the game. Do any of you guys play Sim Airport? I know that's another one that um, a few people have been playing. Let's get a door in line there. Or let's get one. Click plus. Press the plus. Am I going blind? That's the plus. I'm pretty blind, Kevin, so you have to be a bit more specific. Where is the plus? Don't know. Flight monitor, I've got any flights in for the moment. Flight planner, yeah, I remember that. I remember the flight planner, guys, that's about it. Assign administrators to do the project. Ah, okay. Operations, R&D. Ah, sorry. There we go. There we pop. And then, oh yeah, then you get the percentage. Okay, sorry guys. I got it, I got it. Thanks, Kevin. Beautiful. And I assume I unlock these little bits as we go. So I assume we're on this one, aren't we? Regional Airport. Redeploy contractor. We don't need to do that because we've got rid of our contractors because we're um, we're fearless. So we'll do that. And then what do we do after that? Place at least two small checking desks, which I assume vending machine, street lights, floodlights, fence. I assume I don't have the checking desks and stuff yet. Okay, that makes sense. Weather station, contactar. Cool. So we'll wait for our uh, R&D project to be completed and then it's better to employ just one. Yeah, that makes sense. That I like that idea, Kevin. Let's employ one and then it'll get off our back then, won't it? There we go. Complete the project commercial license. Yeah, that's what we're doing now. Here we go. Right. Yeah, we've done that. Okay. Get some says never played Sim Airport but watched a couple of videos. Not impressed with it. I've played Airport CEO 
from when it was first available. Ah, interesting. I've never played some airport. Um, a couple of my fellow YouTube friends um, play lots of Sim Airport. Um, I, I personally preferred Airport CEO. Uh, I kind of preferred like the graphics and like you know the gameplay, uh, but I haven't tried some Airport, so I can't say much about it to be honest. Um, yeah, I, I know a lot. I know it's quite a heated debate in the community because obviously you know some people obviously prefer some airports some people obviously prefer airport ceo don't they so to be honest i think i think it's just really nice that we've got competitors you know there's so many games that I just have not got competitors you know look at city skylines i i just can't think of one game you know the only game that i think that i could ever compete with city skylines is is um probably sim city 4. you know sim city 4 I mean, that came out, when did that come out? 2000? No, I agree, Getson. What I'm saying is more of um, more of being able to have two. I think it, what it does is it, I think it forces the developers to be a bit more um, cutting edge. I think it forces the game devs to develop the games, which is really good. Right, so now we need to do check-in desk, security checkpoints, all that kind of jazz, don't we? So we've got security here, okay, and then we've got the checking desks in here. That's information, checking desk, board and desk, okay. So checking desks, we only need two. I assume they're going that way round, aren't they? So maybe we go, uh, was it around before this one? I didn't know that. Um, I didn't know that some airport was out first. I never knew that. Let's get out. I think we'll go for four. Select new project. Okay. Don't let your administrators sleep. Okay. Click to start new project. Um. What could we do? What would you guys suggest? Maybe night flights. That makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? And the medium aircraft, yeah, I love that, but I think night flights might be a good one to start with. What's floor construction? Ah, so you can get, oh, you can get new floors in the game. Yeah, I saw that, stairs, escalators. I saw that you can increase your amount of floors. Now that's cool, and remote stands. Um, air side shuttle, a bus. I think I'm gonna go with night flights. It's quite a short project as well. So let's assign both of those administrators to that project. Right, we've got our check-in desks. Zone a suitable part of the terminal as secure and mark the check-in desks and make sure the check-in desks are not inside the secure zone. Yep, not a problem. Right, so then what I was going to do is then you'd go into the security checkpoints. I was thinking here. Uh, oh, they need to be in the secure zone. Okay, so if we went like this up to there, so where do I need to go up to? So I'd want that up to that square there, I think, and if we can get a few along that, this line here. So let's do that. I'll get a little zone behind there, that's maybe staff. I don't know if that's needed or not, but and if we can get these in here. So if we went like, I don't know how many we can get. Let's get two. Okay includes the door okay lovely and then that bit behind there will say is also staff beautiful and then is it worth us getting in a wall terminal wall we don't want a fence do we? we don't want a fence inside so if we get the wall up there lovely look at that isn't that beautiful some research topics do give you a distinct advantage if you research them first, but it's up to you what you want to research and when. Okay, doke. I thought I'd go with night flights because that seemed like a logical next choice. Um, zone secure, including the door. This door here, isn't it? Now we're going to have to get some kind of um, two. Oh, okay. Ask oh, secure zone one. Okay. That makes more sense. We need to get someone in here. Um, is it sidewalk here? I'm not sure. 
then we're going to want a security exit. So what I was going to do is I was going to get a wall to come in. Well, how big is the security exit actually? How large? Must border an open secure zone like that. So if I got rid of four, four, one, two, three, four security then we pop that in I kind of want that more like there beautiful there we go there's our exit right there we go I like that I like that a lot so you can come down here whoop straight through that door beautiful right what have I got to do now place a boarding desk near each stand so if I get some more doors going up here, I think I want for medium. So if we get one there and there, then we can come into security and we're going to say that this is all going to be a secure zone. Like that, we'll make sure the doors are done. Lovely. And then we've got the boarding desk. Information, check in, boarding desk. Right, so. I think we need one for each stand, don't we? What way round? There we want to go that way round. So let's get, um, we'll go one, two, three, four, five. We'll just pop them anywhere for a minute. Yeah, okay, that's fair enough. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, get some to get a bit of money first. That makes sense. Click on each boarding desk and connect it to the nearest stand adjacent. Not a problem. Connect stand. I remember all of these bits. It's all familiar, guys. It's all flooding back to me. And uh, that to connect outside box bus stop. Oh, cool. And then that last one there. Click on each stand and enable commercial flights. There we go, commercial flights. Why do you not? Um, missing taxiway path to a runway supporting small aircraft. That should support small aircraft. Commercial flights, there we go. That should be fixed now. Um, like that. Like that. And I might keep one of general aviation maybe. Um, when building, turn off the zone view. Or oh, how do I do that? Don't know. Right, you all come up with errors. Now, why are you erroring? Ah, security checkpoint. Right. How do I do that then? Uh, build queue. This security checkpoint is not operated. Okay, that might be something I need to do now. Let's pause the game. Hi, four passenger service agents. Okay. Um, they take. Passenger service assistance. Passenger service agent. Here we go. So we've got a few here. Not many are green. You two are green. And how do we need four? Now we'll get the yellow and the yellow. When you walk to a plane in real life, do you walk over grass to get to it? No, no, we will get some um, we'll get some sidewalk in. Hire four security officers. Okay. Security officers. Green. Green. How many do I need? Four. Hmm. Uh, we've got two yellows. I think that was four. And four ramp agents. One, two, three, four. Okay. Ah, okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. So let's extend our secure zone. Ah, why are you not? 
Why can't I not zone that? It's because it isn't anything. Secure walkway. One way road, service road. Can't make grass secure. Okay. Uh, is there like a sidewalk or something I can use? Can it be concrete tile or does it have to be the sidewalk? Let's just try it. Hey! Let's just get that sidewalk going. Uh, lovely. Right, let's make that all secure. Lovely. And then they haven't got their error messages now. Beautiful. Right. Uh, wait for your staff to arrive by public transport. Let's unpause the game. And enable ramp agent service. Ramp agent service. Get some, I love learning new things. Oh, it's good, isn't it? It's very satisfying. Um, I, I love playing games like, um, I don't know, uh, Grand Theft Auto, Far Cry 5, Resident Evil, you know, like shoot, shooting games basically. You know, like they're fun, I get it, they're fun. But I think this is the beauty of quite, not complex games, but I think this is the beauty of like management and building games. Is it's, I, I completely agree with you. I love, I love learning new things. Um, I just love it. Shall we turn general aviation off for some of these or can we keep it on? Is it better to turn it off? Like that one I've got it on. Allow... I think we'll go all commercial. What do you guys think? I'm not too sure. It will be better to keep one or two as general aviation if you guys would agree. We can set our first commercial flight. Open an airline and master contract. Okay. Offered contracts. Here we go. Look. Edwards Bay, Fly Penguin. What airline would you guys like to see as our first airline that we get in our hospital? I think there's loads of potential for some developer to build a really really decent airline like airline tycoon do you guys remember airline tycoon god i love that game we, could, we should play that at some point we should play airline tycoon i've got it on my steam library it's such a good game i feel like there hasn't been any good airline like airline tycoon games airline management games and this is like kind of airline management like a really detailed airline management game would be so cool small aircraft but regional air Okay, small, small. They have two small penguin. They've got two. Let's just go for fly penguin. Let's go fly penguin. Wee! Kevin played Airline Tycoon. Bloody hell, I love Airline Tycoon. It was so good. Um, I loved it. I just absolutely loved it. Right, so how do I do this again? Uh, I want just small aircraft. Three schedules in advance. Too close to an adjacent flight. Ah, oh, that's now, isn't it? I need to go to Wednesday. Here we go. Right, let's get it off first. First in the morning. I don't know how many I can get off. I'm going to stagger these a little bit. Stagger them by about half an hour. I don't know if that's too much or, or not enough. We can get in some more, um, more contracts as well, can't we? Let's get in one more one more um, airline oh forest there airline tycoon what a game have we got a few more um, none in there we've got some forest there yeah so let's go there i don't know if you have to stagger them or not i might be doing this all wrong i just i don't know i always feel like it's better to stagger just so it doesn't get too congested. So what, what are our times? Um, eight, half eight. So that needs to be 
nine, doesn't it? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing really. Half an hour is okay. Okay, lovely. Okay. Auto planner, prompt, flight capacity, minimum flight separation 30 minutes. One hour is better for a bigger plane. Okay. Eight, eight thirty. Let's re can I reschedule that to be um, nine. Then we'll reschedule that one to be half nine. There we go. Just we're not wasting too much time. Okay, lovely. Now sit back and wait for the scheduled flight and passengers to arrive and depart. You can view more details of your flight from the flight monitor. Lovely, chubby. Um, so what's this exclamation mark telling me about? Is it new? Yeah, new flights, isn't it? So let's get that in like so. Have I got any here? No. Okay. Um, auto planner. Do I have that yet or do I not have that? waiting aren't we? I think we're just waiting now. Go. Forest, uh. Beautiful. Is it there? Oh yeah, auto planner. Oh yeah, I haven't got it yet so I need, what does it say? Um, Requires board members COO and CIO. Okay, we can get that soon now. Speed up time a little bit. We need to turn around five commercial flights. Okay, that is not a problem. We can do that. We should probably get some flights over here. I forgot about this bit down here, haven't I? So we want that at seven, isn't it? There's another one. So that wants to be half past. These need to be rescheduled really because I've just popped them in a little bit too late. I popped an hour in there so there we go. Bam, 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 bam. Slide penguin. Okay let's see that for a minute. Flight separation to 35 minutes. Lovely, lovely. Oh, I'd like to get the auto planner at some point. This is a bit annoying having to keep coming and doing this, isn't it? Okay. I don't know if we've had, have we had any commercial flights yet? I'm not sure. And can I turn on night mode yet? We're not done yet. Um, 100%. It's a hundred percent and why can I not why can't I do it? Um don't know what to do next. Feel free to suggest guys what you'd like to see us do next. Maybe medium aircraft? Remote stands? Not sure. Let me know. Let me know what you want to see us research next. Let's get some more flights in. There's a Fly Penguin and One Forest Air. Jet A1 Fuel. Okay. Jet A1 Fuel. J1 Fuel. Start project. I'm going to trust you, Kevin. I'll we'll pop two administrators on that. There we go. Let's speed up time a tad. What I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to very, very quickly just go and refill uh, refill my drink. It's rather hot tonight. So I'll leave it on double speed. And then let's leave it on... Yeah, I'll leave it on double speed, okay? I'll, I'll literally be about one minute. And I'll quickly go and get some... Get a... Uh, oh, I'll get off the page there. 
go and get a drink. I'll be two minutes. I'll see you guys very, very, very shortly. Why am I keep going off the bloody airport? Okay, so two seconds. I'm back. Oh, it's hot again tonight. It's so hot in the evenings at the moment. It's horrible. Runway lights. Do I get that? Is that like an upgrade? Upgrade to asphalt. Or is that a project? Is that a project that we could have done? Oh, start a new project. That was quick. Advanced runway lighting. I assume that's the one. I assume that is the one. 24 hours. That's the one, guys, isn't it? Yep, let's do that. Again, let's track our two administrators on that. Lovely, right? Let's read up time a little bit more. And we'll have a look at our flight plan of the day. And we'll get a few more. Have I done it again? I've done it again. I keep rescheduling these bit too late so sorry everyone that's a bit of a holiday that's now having it rearranged by an imbecile there we go For oh got loads of bloody forest air ones look there we go have a pretty full day here in the airport too close to an adjacent flight what bloody hell are you on about why is that one? Are there even bigger gaps or is it just me? And that one's gone back to being... Oh, this is the same... Oh, I don't know. More admin, quicker research speed. There's a flight in the next day. Ah. Ah, oh, so some of them are for multiple days. I didn't know that. sense now. It's all sense now guys. Here we go, look we've got passengers in our airport. Do I need to do queues? International airport. Um, wow this is going great, oh, thanks so much. Thank you so much. That is magic. Unlock any adjacent land by clicking on a padlock. Okay, I think I want to unlock this one, don't I? I? At some point I'll get a longer runway. Um, I probably want to start thinking about upgrading my runway. How much that cost? 50,000. That's not much, is it, to upgrade it to asphalt? So I can do that. I need to unlock any adjacent land. 750 grand? Are you having a joke, Kim? 750,000 pounds. Medium aircraft. Right, we can get the research project going. I um, know we can't because that's going. Okay. And um, I could get in some more administrators to work on the new project, couldn't I? Should we do that? Let's do that. You only live once, don't you? Train. No, I want to buy more, please. Or well, not buy, hire. We're going to get in you and we're going to get in you. Then we're going to go to operations, R&D projects, and we're going to, oh, I can't start a new one. Bugger. Well, let's pop all of you on that one and hopefully that will go faster then, won't it? 
Okay. What to hire a procurement director? Need a toilet and sit here. You're right, get some. Let's get some uh, let's get some stuff in. Right, so we'll get in a bathroom. We'll get a bathroom here quite close to our entrance. We're gonna want some walls to go around that because we do not want to go for a wee or a poo where there is no privacy. And we'll get a small door. Right, and then here we have toilets. Right, let's get some get some. Let's get this whole wall to be toilets. A nice big bathroom with lots of capacity. Should we get a few urinals? Let's get a few urinals there. Then I think I'll pop in another wall. Just so it's a bit private over there if you do want to go for a wee using a, a urinal. Get one more. We've got sinks and hand dryers. Right, so let's get sinks on that wall. And we'll get a few hand dryers there. And then floor. Let's go for like a tile or something. Clinker. Should we try this? Oh, isn't that lovely? Isn't that lovely? You need both male and female toilets. Damn it. So do I need to build this again, but have like a one for male, one for female? I didn't know that, did I? So how do I put logo? I am, uh, yeah. I'm just, I'm just trying to be, you know, down with the kids, guy. I'm just trying to be down with the kids. How do I make that? Or do I just need to build two? Do I just need to build one more and then they'll kind of auto assign to male and female? I'm not sure. You guys have got to let me know because I'm not sure. Let's get another one in here. Put that in there. That looks right. Um, like that. Then we've got the door. I think it's, it's becoming more popular like in real life as well, I think, isn't it? Uh, I know like, quite a lot of pubs and clubs are starting to do unisex toilets. So I, don't, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. I think it's, um, it's an interesting idea. I think it's a bit strange. Um, it, is, it is an interesting idea. That is, um, to say the least. What do you guys think? Ah, allow gender. Ah, oh, we're going to be unisex, guys. Let's let's. We're going to be unisex. Allowed person. Passenger, employee, or both? No, both. Anyone? Anyone coming to our toilets? Boy, gal. Anyone. We'll do a different tile in there. I think it's a different tile anyway. Um, get some says uh, they think it's someone that should be kept separate. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I really don't know how I feel about it. it um, you have to be careful, don't you? You have to be careful when talking about that kind of thing. Um, I need to open it. I do not know how to open it. Thanks, guys. Um, so yeah, it, it's an interesting topic. It is an interesting topic. Uh, I'm not really sure. I don't really have any opinion on it, really. Um, like I, don't, I don't know. Not that I don't really care, but like I don't really care. Like I, I, I don't think it bothers me. Right, so that's all done. How is our, how's our project going? Let's go and love it. Okay. So I see why I can unlock, unlock ugh, if I can speak, unlock this at a later date. So we can do that. Um, what else do I need to do? Seats. I've forgotten seats, haven't I? Right. Large. Getting some seats through here. Like that. A few benches out and around. You can sit down. And we'll get a um, seat out here. I don't know if we will use a seat out here or not. Not sure. About switching toilet gender. I think I was going to keep them as unisex guys, but I'm going to keep them as Anyone can come into our toilets. Okay, look at all the stuff in as well. Uh, one contractor. 
This is going to be the laziest so-and-so in the world. So I'm not going to do anything. Is it worth getting a little toilet up here? Okay, let's start one. Let's get a little staff toilet. Only very big. Um, you tried, yeah, you tried. Maybe later. Maybe later we can get some um, specific toilets. No, I don't know. This is going to be a, a bathroom. And we're going to have two stools, two urinals, two sinks. Uh, oh no, 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 delete. No, no, just delete it. Okay. And then we'll put two hand dryers on that wall. That can be open. Lovely. Let's start toilet. Right. And then that's going to be a start. Oh no, I set it in here, don't I? Uh, so that's just staff. Executives only. Oh no. Any staff, any staff. So if they need, a, need to use the, um, the, the toilet, they can go for it. Okay, right, so we need to purchase at least one stair trap. Now, can I do that now? No. Okay. I need to unlock something before. I might need to unlock medium aircraft maybe before I can get stair trap. Upgrade a small grass stand, stand to either concrete or asphalt. Hire a procurement director and we need to start doing the jet A1 fuel stuff. Okay. Okay. That's not a problem. That's not a problem. I don't know what time we're going to be streaming to tonight, guys. Um, uh, all right, let's repair. So how do I... Oh, okay, so I need to unlock medium aircraft first, don't I? And what we're currently doing, we're not doing that though, are we? We're doing something else. Advanced runway lighting, I think, yeah. Okay. So we can maybe we'll upgrade maybe a couple of these. Um, pretty cheap. Let's upgrade a couple of these now here and that. I think there's one, one of them there. One of them there wants us to upgrade. So we'll upgrade a couple of them. Okay. I think all is going well. What's this chap doing? Hup, hup. There you go, look. What's an employee? You are a rad agent. Oh, okay, okay. That project is taking a while. I just said it was going to take a while, to be fair. 36%, okay. Well, can I pop in any more flights? That's too soon, isn't it? I could do them for tomorrow, though. Okay, let me pop some of these in. Fly penguin! And then we've got some forest. Oh, not, no forest there at the moment. Okay, okay. Not a problem, not a problem. Um, free speed, yeah. Should be on free speed, really, shouldn't I? There we go, that should be a little bit better now, and the day should progress a little bit faster. Ah, lovely. Let's finish upgrading these. Like that. Beautiful. Oh, it, looks, it looks so much better. Um, I'm going to create this as well. I'm doing it because I'm doing it. I've done it. I've just gone absolutely mental. And we'll upgrade this as well. Can I upgrade that in here? Or do I just go over it? Structure location, not possible. Yeah, that's the runway entry and exit. So we want to do that. There we go. Because we'll work that. And to there. And then entry and exit. I don't want those. Oh, can we upgrade these? No. Okay. So let's get some new ones of those. Uh, I might need to delete those first. Let's just pause the game. We've got instant building, which is good. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, thank you for joining us. I'm six, uh, six thirty-five a.m. No problem, I hope you have a really good day at work, buddy. Let's delete those two. 
pop in the new entries and exits. There we go, beautiful. There we go, beautiful. And this one here needs to be exit only. And we're just going to check this as entry only. Uh, nope, that way. 4 a.m. Dr. Kevin. I don't think it's going to be a stream that's going on for too, you know, like too long, Dr. Kevin. Maybe we'll start finishing up around half past. Um, I definitely need to get some uh, some sleep tonight. I had a busy day out there in the garden today, which is good. You know, it always feels productive, doesn't it, when you um, when you do lots of jobs. It's just it's tiring. It's tiring, guys. But it's it's a good tiring. It's a productive tiring, which is good. Um, much better than normal tiring. For some of these flights are going to... Let's reschedule that. We'll pop that closer to up here. Like there. We'll just stagger these a little bit. Um, I'll put you in. One goes on the other day. One going there, lovely. Can I get one in there? No. One in there, yes. I might want to get something here. Ah, I can get something here. Hey, Theodore, how are you doing? Uh, when will you make the next Project Hospital Live? That's every Thursday. Every Thursday, Theodore is Project Hospital Live. Um, and then on Sundays, we kind of just play. We tend to, we tend to just play what I want to play. Um, like nothing. Nothing specific, uh, so we're playing this tonight. Where do I, they're all night stands, aren't they? Um, but yeah, Project Hospital is always on the Thursdays. And then we just play whatever we feel like on a, on a Sunday. Anything can happen Sundays. Sunday fun day. Saturday. Can't get anything on that. That's Sunday. Nope, nope. Yes. Yeah. Uh, nope, nope, yes, and yes, there we go. See you later, get some, take care my friend. Okay, so this is going well guys, this is going very, very well. I'm happy with this. And there's loads of, um, there's loads of new things, isn't there? Like, this is, I think there's a few bits in here, like a, Bench? I don't think the bench was over there. It might have been. It might have been. I might have just overlooked it. Decorations. Let's give some large plants. And we'll get these kind of just around. A bit like that. Just spruce it up a little bit. We've been stuck for four hours. Dr. Kevin, I really appreciate that. I really, really do. That is incredibly kind of you to uh, get up in the middle of the night and come and watch me play games badly <coughs> oh excuse me guys excuse me I'm um my sneezes are quite loud my sneezes are fairly loud right so that's all good I like that so I kind of have to keep going how's our project going 82% uh, lovely 83% that's lovely that's gonna be finishing very very soon very soon. I hope you're going to be going back to sleep after this, Dr. Kevin. I hope you're going to be going back and getting some more beauty sleep. I hate to think that I've disturbed your sleep, um, your night sleep that much. Look at this, look how many people sitting in here. What are they waiting for? Let's get some more seating in there then. An object is filthy at ah, no chance. Let's just slow the game down a tad. And we're going to get in some janitors. Janitors, let's get in. You're pretty good. You're pretty good. You're pretty good. Getting free for the sec. That should be good. Do we need maintenance people as well? Is that something that we also need? Staff. Service technician. Oh, yeah, there's none there. Do we need one? Let's just get one. I assume they'll just go around and um, get a few bit. Oh, they're waiting for check in, that makes sense. They're waiting for check in. 
Okay, lovely, lovely. So we need that project to finish, really, don't we? Then we can start getting the other stuff researched. Let's just speed up the time. We'll go on triple speed. We'll go on triple speed and we'll just wait until this project is done and then we can start on the medium aircraft project. I just need again. Is it gonna is it gonna come out? <coughs> Excuse me guys, sorry. Right, really close to finishing now. 98%. Lovely jubbly and we'll make sure that that next project gets gets started as soon as possible. Here we go, 100%, lovely. And we're getting those lights. So now we need to do medium aircraft permit. And we'll set how many administrators we have with this four on that. And then we need to upgrade our aircraft lights. Add approach lights. Add puppy lights, convert to grass. We don't want to convert to grass, but we'll add both lights. What's this? The puppy light? Where do I pop that then? I'll just leave around in places, guys. I don't know if that's right or wrong. While waiting, you can set up the Jet A1 fuel. Okay. So I need to complete the Jet A1 fuel research project, which we've done. I need to purse it, purchase. I need to purchase. A Jet A1 fuel truck. Vehicles, purchase vehicles, Jet A1 truck. I'm going to order one. There we go, it's going to take 45 minutes. Let's speed up time. Then we need to enable the Jet A1 fuel service, which I assume will come online once we order the truck. And then purchase a pushback truck, which I can't do yet. On the left of the runway. Okay. And then can I go here, upgrade, and uh, build puppy light. That fat guy in McDonald's eating a salad, it's just because I love you. It's just because I love you so much, I thought, oh, I better, I better, I better play all the games that um, that fat guy in McDonald's eating a salad plays. It's weird, isn't it? You, I think you, you find that quite a lot. Um, that, you know, people just, people do tend to kind of play the same games. And uh, this is what the Sunday streams are all about. This is what the Sunday streams are all about. It's having a little bit of fun with a few games that um, I do not take very, I don't take any game seriously, really. Uh, I ended up, I just want to have fun. Um, but yeah, it is interesting how lots of people play very similar games, isn't it? And here we need service road. Where's the service road? I keep losing things. Here we go. Like that, lovely. Right, beautiful. Now we can enable the service. No, I keep clicking on the wrong thing. Operation Jet A1 Fuel Service enabled. Right, flight planner. Can we chuck in anything into our flight planner? Nothing there, but Sunday. We can get a flight in there, that's good. That one there, no, no, no. Let's start popping in a few on Monday. Put these in pretty rough. Lovely. Um, did you make a video about the tweets that Project Hospital made that looked like a new department? I haven't done a video yet that fat guy in McDonald's eating a salad um, because it would be purely speculation and I kind of prefer to know a little bit more about what's coming out first but we will be I mean I think everyone's pretty certain it's going to be some kind of contagious disease infectious disease it's gonna be something like that isn't it um, but as soon as they kind of officially announce it that's when I'll start thinking about making videos and all that kind of jazz. I need a procurement director. So we've got two here. We're going to have to put a yellow, aren't we? And is that it? And there's just a few more bits there. Okay. And how's our project going? Let's speed up time. Let's speed up time. 
but I'll probably use something very close to what we did last time. Um, that fat guy, McDonald's eating a salad. Um, we'll probably just be making you know, a few videos, a little bit of speculation, but mainly it's kind of just showing you the photos, showing you any you know gameplay, any videos or anything. Um, but you know, I'm just I'm just so excited. I'm so happy that the that the developers over at Oxymoron are really, you know, they're just so keen on getting the game developing and new DLC out, which is great. Yeah, no. and especially with what's going on at the moment in the world, you know, it's very relevant, isn't it? You know, PPE, infectious disease, contagious disease, um, you know, kind of micro, micro testing. Um, it'd be great to see if we could have like small scale um, kind of epidemics, endemics, maybe even pandemics within the game. That'd be awesome to kind of see how we can kind of, you know, try and overcome those. That'd be really good. Like super bugs that like you know sweep through the hospital that'd be really cool. Yeah, you know, just things a little bit different, like some more interesting kind of um, events and actions and stuff. That'd be really really cool to see in the game. Um, so it'll be interesting to see what happens on that on that camp, on that um, on that front. Zoom in to the stands. Oh yeah, not a problem. Should we zoom in here? You see kind of. Um, a bit of if you zoom in now that then we'll kind of just wait wait for things to tick over we're currently doing a few research projects we're doing the um, medium aircraft research and development project so we can uh, we can get medium aircraft now we're getting some medium stands we'll get the large jets in then they can be refueled with their jet fuel Everything will be hunky dory, guys. Ah. Yeah, so my, my big ask at the moment is for a game developer to develop a airline tycoon game. A brand new airline tycoon, that would be awesome. I love airline tycoon so much. How's this going? 38%. Okay. I would like to see if the hospitals had a pandemic for the virus and you've got to do infection control and that, yeah that would be awesome wouldn't it, that would be so cool. I said before I think it's something that I'd really love to see is stuff like wheelchairs and people with broken arms and broken legs coming in with like slings and kind of like homemade stuff to try and um, like splint their arms and legs, I think that could be really cool. Because at the moment, people are like walking into the hospital with like broken legs. You know, there's no way you just walk in, you know, you'd probably hop in or, you know, come in like a homemade wheelchair or something. You definitely should be walking in. You've been lots and lots of pain. And even like, say you've been on dialysis or like some kind of like really um, like thorough, exhausting kind of treatment or something. It'd be good to see them like leave in a wheelchair or something. That could be quite cool. Or like we've just had a, an operation or something. Yeah, Dr. Kevin, I still have Airline Tycoon installed on this PC, my friend. Um, it's just such a good game. It, it, it needs... The it, thing is, is for its time, because that came out a long time ago, that game, um, it's still really good. It's still so fun as well. I think that should definitely be a game that we play on, on a Sunday. Um, I love Airline Tycoon so much. ALS air transport, the worst of um, worst of the worst injuries. Yeah, that could be so cool. Um, they've got ambulances, and they've got the ambulance kind of um, what am I? What word am I looking for? They've got the ambulance game mechanics working so well. How the ambulance comes in on the road, you get kind of the paramedic coming into the hospital with the patient on a bed on a, on a trolley. It's so cool. Yeah. They could do if, if they can do that. I really hope that they can do helicopters. I know that on the forums they have um, discussed that helicopters will be coming at some point. So um, just so excited to see that. That would be so cool. And yeah, completely agree with you, Dr. Kevin. Um, it's just refreshing sometimes to play these old types of games. I regularly, regularly go back to them like Airline Tycoon, Roller Coaster Tycoon, Railroad Tycoon, Theme Hospital. Like they're so good. Like there's a reason why they were so good. 
And they're still so good now, aren't they? Like, they never really lose that, lose that um, je ne sais quoi. Right, how's the project going? I feel like it's taken a while. 60%, okay. That's not bad, that's not bad. Yeah, no, that, that would be really cool. I'd love to see some new new transports and stuff. That would be good. Right, so we've done quite a lot. Um, we do need to extend our runway, don't we? So I imagine we can't do that runway upgrades. Um, we can't do that here. Do I need to go to place down a different runway? I thought I could just upgrade. Upgrade this one. Or is it because it knows I haven't got um, the space? It might know I haven't got the space, possibly. But we are going to have to buy it at some point, so we might as well just get it now. Can I upgrade it now? No. Oh, I need, I need to get. I need to do the um, research project, don't I? I need to do the research project. I have to delete and build a new one. Ah, okay. Okay, not a problem. Well, we'll leave it going how it is at the moment. Lovely. Look at our little passengers walking around our airport. Our little check-in desk. Everyone's got lovely heads. Look at all these lovely heads, look. Lovely. Hello, Levi. Good evening. I need to get a new one. Yeah, not a problem. I'll, um... I thought you could just upgrade it. Was that how it used to be? I'm sure that's how it used to be, and if I'm, I'm going mental, I haven't played the game in quite a while. I'm pretty sure you could just upgrade it, but that's not a problem. We'll um, we'll delete it and build a new one when we get around to it. That's not a problem at all. Okay, we've got these little people with their little bag. Oh, I wish, that's what I need right now, guys. I need a holiday. I actually, if, um, if coronavirus hadn't swept across the globe, I would be in Greece right now, so that's quite depressing, isn't it? Well, it's not depressing because I'm here with you, lovely people, but um, it can be quite annoying. In the Jumbo Jet update, ah, okay, cool. Thanks, that Levi. That's good to know. Let's repair it. Start to feel, um, start to look a bit worse for wear. And we'll uh, um, repair our stands. Lovely, lovely, beautiful. Beautiful. What are you waiting for? Are you waiting for a bus? I love this little passport bit. That's so cool as well. I'll follow them. I think I'm waiting for a bus. I think we've got enough car stops and bus stops there. I think we've got enough. I hope we've got enough anyway. Beautiful. Beautiful. See you later, Levi. Take care of yourself, mate. Get some as followed 18 minutes ago. I'm so sorry, get some. I missed that. And thank you, the apps, for the follow as well. Sorry, guys, it's just been, um, it's been so hot here tonight. I haven't had my headphones on for the whole stream. But thank you for following if you are still tuned in. See you later, Levi. Take care of yourself. It should be that trauma docs and nurses have PP on always. Yeah, no, that'd be cool. But the little, um, oh, those noises. Can't fly if you zoom in. How cool is that? Yeah, that'd be cool. Have like aprons on. Because you don't want to get blood on you guys, do you? You don't want to get blood on you all the time if you're an A&E doctor or a nurse. How's our project? 93%. Lovely. Lovely. And as soon as we've got that project, we can start purchasing the other bits that we need. Like a stair truck, a pushback truck. And we need to get a medium stand. Okay. Okay. Cool. We'll do that. We shall do that. I love your name, by the way. That fat guy in McDonald's eating a salad. That has one, got to be one of the best names I've seen on YouTube and Twitch. That's a good name. And I applaud you for it. Right, how's it going? How's it going? Oh, look how close it is. 
see you later that fat guy at McDonald's eating a salad. Take care of yourself and have a great day. Right, so that's done. So what should we do next? Maybe a remote stand or maybe baggage handling? Uh, let's do baggage handling. No, I don't know. I'm going to leave it to you guys. I'm going to leave it and then I'll do whatever you guys think will be best. Right, so we need to purchase at least one step truck. Let's go to here. We need to get one of those and one of those. We'll get two of each, I think. Let's get two of each. We'll go a bit mental. We'll go a bit crazy. So we've done that. We need to build a medium stand. Right. And we also need two. That's a medium runway. Um, aircraft stand. So let's get, we'll get in two, I think. I don't think we want to go too crazy for the moment. So I think we're going to get in two. Ah, yeah, I forgot about that, didn't I? Uh, delete, no, wait, what are you doing? I need to delete you. Why is it not deleting? Um, demolish. Active stand, close stand first. Okay, turn them off. Alright, so let's do the road first. It's probably a better idea for adders. Need a road. Where's our road? Service road. That comes down. And along. I don't know where it goes. So. Aircraft stand, medium. You want to go like that. Lovely. So I'll get two for the moment, I think. There we go. Lovely, lovely. Right, and that in there just kind of needs to be concrete. Is that that? Oh, I think there's a tile somewhere, isn't there? Um, you, concrete tile. No, wait, wait, where, where have you gone? Oh, I'll get that in there. Lovely, beautiful. Right. So you need a checking desk thing. So if we were to delete that bit of road, and if we were to increase our foundation, and we'll get that coming all the way down there, a bit like that, then we can delete that wall there and there. Um, and then we need some more security. So if we delete um, this wall in here, and I'll delete that there as well, then we can get some more security checkpoints, which needs to be in the secure zone. So let's get that going down. Then we need... Should we go medium? I think we should go medium for a bit of a change. Then we'll get some... We'll get two of those in. Like that. I think we'll get some more checking desks over here. Again, we can get some medium ones maybe, just to spice it up a little bit. Wait, what? No, I want, oh sorry, I want checking this. I'll get some along here. We'll get in another, get in another four, I think. Desks, no desks, checking desks. There. Okay. Right, I want to connect these. Um, what have I done here? Oh, I need board and desks, don't I? And I need to change the runway. So let's get in some medium board and desks. What way around is that facing? That should be that way. And I'll get one there. And one down here. Need to get some doors. I'll get the medium doors to go out onto the tarmac. I hope. Hmm. Let's change where those doors go. So that's going to be. Right, medium. I think it was around here. You can see the icon there. And the icon's about there. And delete that. We can get in the walls, as that's not a, an actual building. Lovely. Yeah, please. Okay. Um, Teodor, if you don't mind, I have a question about Project Hospital. After the next live, could you put your hospital on the Steam Workshop? Yeah, sure. Yeah, not a problem at all. 
How do I do that, Kevin? Do I do that here? Let me know how you do it, and I, I, we can tell off the zone. Okay, so we're going to connect this with a stand. Connect the stand. There we go. We need to do the taxiway path. Comes to there. Right, lovely. The button is below there. Um, Toggle terminal. Oh, yeah, room over there. I assume it's this. That's, oh, that's zoning. There we go. There we go. Right, so we need to delete this runway. I need to get in our medium runway, don't we? Medium runway. And we'll get that going like that. Look at that, beautiful, beautiful. Do I want... So I need to extend this really, don't I? Or should I just get another one? I think I might just get another one. Um, it must be connected to a runway. So we want that, but the other side. No, other side. A bit like that. Or shall we just have a straight one come off? There we go. And we need taxiway foundation. And it's four, isn't it? Um, so let's go that in. Then we'll connect this all up. Beautiful. And then we'll get in that there. And we want this to be a no entry. So let's just change that to be one way, like so. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Five wide. Is this too? Is this too narrow now, Kevin? Or did I just say the wrong thing? One, two, three, four, five. It's. I think one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it's five wide. Right. Okay. Lovely. So now we can turn that small craft, small aircraft can come down there as well. We'll turn it on. So I think that's all working. What are you moaning about? This security checkpoint is not operated. Ah, yes. We need more security people, don't we? Let's get some more ramp agents as well. I don't know how many we need. We'll just get all of them available. And we'll also get some more security officers. I don't know how many we need. I don't know if that's enough or not. I'm not too sure. Okay, so that's going well. We're getting some seating. And then next episode we'll be getting in some toilets and everything. I'll get a bit more seating this time so I think there'll be lots more passengers here this time. Now we've got some medium aircraft. Right, and then we want a wall somewhere like there, don't we? Just to keep that all separate. Oh gosh, it's going well guys, it's going well. Right now we're going to need to get some medium flights in. So we need to go into here and we say we also accept medium flights. I think we're going to need these to be really staggered. So let's confirm that. Passenger service agent, okay. Can't allocate to this stand. Okay. Ah, there we go. I was on the wrong one. I was on the wrong ones, guys. So that's all small. And that's small as well. That also plan would come in very nicely at the moment. Have I got any mediums in? No, all small. Get some up here. Okay. Passenger serviced agent. Those are the guys that go on like the um, the desks, aren't they? So let's get everyone that's not red. I think I accidentally got a red. 
You've open slot on the early morning. Is that today? On Monday. Have got any room there? Got some room here though. Loads of um, forest air flights. Bam, 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 bam. It's a catchy little tune, isn't it? Okay, lovely. Right. So I think it's that's probably a good natural stopping point for this tonight, guys. Um, I am sorry it's not quite as long as normal. Uh, it's been quite a long day, and uh, kind of need a little bit of sleep tonight. Need a little bit of sleep. Um, but I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Yeah, actually, so actually we wouldn't be finishing too far, um, too far away now anyway. Actually, so. I really hope you enjoyed that. We do need some more security personnel. Let's just do that before I forget. And um, give the video a like on YouTube and follow on Twitch if you haven't already. Um, just show me that um, you're enjoying um, Airport CEO on the channel, which I really hope you are. Um, I really hope you have an awesome day or night wherever you are. Kevin, make sure you get some sleep. Teodor, you might have to remind me on Thursday just to pop the hospital on a Steam Workshop. Remind me if I haven't done it already. Um, but absolutely, I'm happy to... I can post it on the Workshop now, and then we can also post it on the Workshop when we're done with the hospital as well, can't we? So that's absolutely not a problem. There'll be a few mods which you have to download for it, but not too many at all. Okay, guys, so I'm going to leave it here for tonight. Have an awesome day or night wherever you are in the world. Stay safe, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you later.